Imagine there was a compound that could trick your body into thinking it's exercising even when you're sitting on the couch. Sounds like fiction, right? Well, I've been testing something called SLUPP332 for the past 12 weeks during my fat loss phase and let me tell you something, this stuff is absolutely fascinating. I'm Caesar from Shapeable and today I'm breaking down what this compound is, how it works and the results I've seen. Before we dive in, if you are into cutting edge fitness science explained in a way that actually makes sense, hit the subscribe button and turn the notification bell on right now. I post new videos breaking down the latest in body transformation science every single week and trust me, you don't want to miss what's coming next. All right, let's get into SLUPP332. So what exactly is SLUPP332? The boring scientific name is Selective Estrogen Receptor Modulator. But what it really is, is a compound that mimics some of the benefits of exercise at the cellular level. Think of it like this. When you exercise, your body triggers a whole cascade of beneficial changes. Your cells create more energy factories, called mitochondria, you burn more fat, and your metabolism gets more efficient. SLUPP332 essentially pushes some of those same buttons, but without you having to do all the work. Now, I need to be super clear. This isn't some magic pill that replaces exercise. It's more like a booster that amplifies what happens when you do exercise. It's like having a tailwind when you're cycling instead of a headwind. You still need to pedal, but you'll go faster with the same effort. So let me break down how SLUPP332 actually works. First, it flips on your body's energy sensor switch, something called AMPK. Think of AMPK as your body's fuel gauge and fuel selector. When activated, it tells your body, hey, let's burn fat for energy instead of storing it. This is the same switch that gets flipped when you do cardio. Second, it tells your cells to build more power plants. Your cells have these tiny energy factories called mitochondria. The more you have, the more efficiently your body produces energy and burns fat. SLUPP332 essentially sends a message saying, we need more power plants, just like exercise does. Third, it makes your muscles better at using insulin. Insulin is like a key that unlocks your cells to let sugar in. When your muscles are more sensitive to insulin, more nutrients go toward building muscle instead of being stored as fat. In animal studies, researchers have seen some pretty impressive results. Up to 70% better endurance, imagine being able to run almost twice as long, about 25% more fat burning, less body fat without eating less food, and better blood sugar control. What's really cool is that this benefit showed up even in animals that weren't exercising, though the effects were much stronger when combined with exercise, of course. It's like SLUPP332 and exercise are best buddies that work better together. Now let's talk about how people are actually using this stuff. This is important because the dosing for SLUPP332 is quite different from what you might expect. First, let's talk about timing. SLUPP332 has a relatively short half-life of about two to four hours meaning half of it is clear from your system in that time frame. It typically reaches peak levels in your bloodstream within 30 to 60 minutes of taking it. But here's the interesting part. Even though it leaves your system relatively quickly, the metabolic effects last much longer, about six to eight hours, because it triggers changes in gene expression that persist after the compound itself is gone. Because of this short half-life but extended impact, most users find multiple daily doses work best. Based on anecdotal reports and early research, the sweet spot for most people seems to be 250 to 300 micrograms per dose, taken three to four times throughout the day, for a total daily dose of 750 to 1,200 micrograms. Some people push higher, up to 2,000 micrograms daily, but most find 1,000 micrograms effective with fewer side effects. For my experiment, I started conservatively at 600 micrograms per day, split into three doses of 200 micrograms each. As I assess my tolerance and response, I gradually increase to my current dose of 1,000 micrograms daily, divided into five doses of 200 micrograms each. This approach gave me more consistency coverage throughout the day. I've got a big disclaimer for you though. SLUPP332 is still considered a research compound. It's not approved for human use by health authorities and we don't have long-term safety data. So anyone thinking about trying it should understand these limitations. Ideally, work with a healthcare provider who can monitor your health markers if you decide to experiment with it. All right, let's get into the part you probably care about most. What actually happened when I took this stuff for 12 weeks during my fat loss phase? The measurable results were great. I lost about 10% more fat than during my previous cut with a similar calorie deficit. 
I actually got stronger on some lifts while eating less, which almost never happens. My fasting blood sugar improved from 92 to 84, and my resting heart rate dropped by 7 beats per minute. But the day-to-day -day effects were what really surprised me. Within the first week, I noticed I felt slightly warmer throughout the day. Not sweaty or uncomfortable just a pleasant warmth that suggested my metabolism was skyrocketing. This feeling stayed consistent throughout the 12 weeks. By week two, my cardio sessions felt noticeably easier. I could push harder and recover faster between intervals. Usually when I'm in a calorie deficit, my cardio performance tanks, but this time it actually improved. But the biggest shock was what happened with my weight training. Normally when cutting, I expect to lose some strength. It's just the reality of eating less. But with Slow PP332, I maintained all my lifts and even added weight to some exercises despite being in a calorie deficit. That's pretty much unheard of in my experience. Energy-wise, I didn't get that mid-afternoon crush that usually hits me when I'm dieting. You know, that feeling when you're cutting calories and around 3 p.m. you feel like you need an up? That was significantly reduced. As for side effects, I had some mild headaches during the first week that went away on their own. I also noticed I felt a bit warmer at night, which affected a little bit my sleep until I turned down the thermostat in my bedroom. Beyond that, I didn't experience anything concerning. Now, before you start googling where to buy Slew PP332, there are some important things to keep in mind. First, we are still in the early days with this compound. The science behind it makes sense and the early data looks promising, but we don't have those gold standard human clinical trials yet. Second, everyone's body is different. What worked well for me might not work the same for you, and that's just how biology works. Third, this isn't a substitute for the basics. I was still training hard five days a week and following a structured nutritional plan with a moderate calorie deficit. SLUPP332 definitely enhanced my results, but it didn't replace good old-fashioned hard work. Fourth, quality matters enormously. Since it's a research compound, there's no FDA oversight ensuring what you're getting is pure or accurately dosed. If you're considering trying it, finding a reputable source is crucial. Finally, if you do try it, getting regular blood work is just a smart practice. While I didn't see any concerning changes in my health markers, monitoring is always a good idea when using newer compounds. Ultimately, Slew PP332 represents one of those fascinating frontiers when science is pushing the boundaries of what's possible with body transformation. It's not a magic pill, because those don't exist, but it does appear to be a powerful tool that can give you an edge when used properly alongside good training and nutrition. My 12-week experiment showed me that it can significantly enhance fat loss, preserve or even improve performance while in a calorie deficit, and help maintain better energy levels throughout a cut. For anyone who struggles with the energy crashes and performance drops that typically come with dieting, well, that's a game changer. As research continues, we'll learn more about the best ways to use it and its long-term effects. For now, it remains an intriguing option for those willing to venture a bit beyond conventional approaches. If you found this breakdown helpful and haven't already, smash that subscribe button and turn the notifications bell on, so you don't miss my upcoming videos on other cutting-edge compounds and strategies. Drop all of your questions in the comments below, and I'll address the most common ones in a future video. This is Caesar from Shapeable, helping you cut through the BS and build your best body based on real science. See you in the next one.